Hi, welcome to Social Research Insights. The mission of Social Research Insights is to promote open source software for both academic and uh, corporate research needs. In this video cast, I'm going to show you a small demonstration as how to write uh, a Beamer presentation by using LaTeX software. Uh, first, let me tell you what is. Let me explain what is LaTeX. LaTeX is a a typesetting software uh, which is used to write the um, documents, manuals, dissertations, thesis, and also other um, research papers and other academic uh, uh, writing. And um, the LaTeX is actually the product of Tex and uh, which was written by Donald Knuth and uh, I think somewhere in the 1990s Lamport developed the text uh, into a new form called LaTeX and we the full form for the LaTeX is Lamport text distribution when he was working in perhaps uh, three international in US and uh, it's very easy to install in Linux you just have to follow this code sudo add apt repository ppa colon text live backports dash backports for slash ppa followed by a command sudo sudo optic super user do sudo means super user do in linux and i'm using ubuntu linux actually i shouldn't say linux and it is a new linux uh, a free software uh, and the LaTeX is also a free software and mostly used for the academic requirements uh, like writing a thesis, a manual, uh, presentation slides or uh, mm, a research report, maybe a research paper like uh, an article. Uh, many things we can do by using uh, LaTeX. Uh, this is a procedure to, s uh, to install LaTeX in or LaTeX in Ubuntu Linux and I'm using Ubuntu 16.04 the latest OS released in 2016 and you just have to give the last command uh, sudo apt in apt get install text live base just like you know go to the sudo apt uh, get uh, install text Lie base that's it and if you are interested you can also add few more uh, names let, uh, related to line uh, latex apart from text live base just like text live latex extra something like that you can just uh, google around uh, what needs to be installed along with latex for technical writing okay and these are uh, this is a little information regarding latex it is a typesetting system designed mostly uh, written by Donald Luth in 1976 which I already told and the latex is a short uh, form for Lamport text and it is a document preparation system and uh, in latex uh, mostly whatever is written in the form of text but by using a mockup code. So LaTeX or LaTeX is basically a mockup language. Okay, and I'm going to show you a small example as how to write uh, mm, a small beam presentation. And this is actually an editor for my background LaTeX distribution. I mean, my LaTeX distribution is is at background behind this editor and this is a text maker you can just go to the software center in Ubuntu there you can search for the text maker or uh, text you can just simply and you'll find here you know text maker just you have to install and you'll get this editor I like text maker there are quite a few text makers available in uh, in uh, new Linux just like Ubuntu so I'm going to give you a small demonstration as how to prepare this beam of presentations in this video cast. The very first command which we need to give in LaTeX, LaTeX is document class. This is highlighted. 
and here we can prepare the article or maybe a manual or maybe a book or maybe uh, mm, there are many things like we can just go online to search for different formats of the document class uh, different names for different document class and that will try to and after compilation we will get uh, that particular uh, output if I mention book here and my output will be book if I mention article here and my output will be the research article something like that there are many more uh, wonderful features which I may not be able to explain through this video cast but for time being I'm going to prepare article and here I'm going to use certain packages mm, this uh, let me say hyper ref which means hyper links uh, I can keep few uh, links for in within my text uh, to so that the users can click on the links and that will redirect them to uh, that particular place and uh, if I'm using hyperref it is just an example okay let's not be serious about this and this is actually the place where we have to declare the class of the document and just beneath of that whatever we write this is actually a place where we have to mention what are the packages that we are going to use Letic has got a wonderful repository package repository is called TAN comprehensive text archive network that you can just uh, go online and search for there are a number of packages available for the needs of the uh, researcher maybe academics or maybe even for uh, corporate uh, uh, document needs uh, writing needs so this is a place where the package information must be mentioned and just below that I will add the title and this title this is my first Beamer presentation or slides and here down I have author information so let me put social research research insights and I don't want to display the date just uh, keep the space within the um, braces empty and my document starts from here begin document so automatically the document will this uh, will try to give the end document automatically but otherwise we have to give these two statements separately and so to, uh, differently <coughs> here make my title make title put some table of contents this I will discuss with you later more in more detail how to create the title page and how to set the table of contents in a systematic way and what is required to set up the table of contents pro possibly in my successive following videos and here we have to store the frame in latex in latex we have to mention we had to create each slide with the help of a uh, couple of statements that are known as begin frame end frame so what I'm going to put this is my first slide and later begin frame the my second frame or slide mm, this is my second slide and now I want to create a frame for itemized uh, um, data or information frame begin itemize and item number one this is item number one this is item number two and this is item number three so that's all so our end uh, this is very important thing we have to end the uh, entire document with uh, backslash and document and this document must be kept within the floor brackets now we have to save this save as or save so somewhere go to some place maybe you can go to your uh, some test uh, 
or maybe yeah some temporary royal there my first and please be cautious that this title should not have spaces and you should in case if you would like to keep some spaces please keep the space with underscore my first slides are beamer presentation press now come back build the copy there is I think is a problem view PDF yeah here article beamer now I think it should be correct now you see if you are after compiling this uh, code the editor must be able to return the output uh, the compilation uh, message in blue color if you get it in red color simply mean that you might be having few setbacks or maybe missing uh, problems in your I mean the mistakes in your code so you just have to click on that particular it will take you back to the particular line and where you can see the mistake and correct it later but here in our case we got this message in blue color which means we we don't have or I don't have any mistakes in my code and here on the right side you can see the slides created as compared by my I'm going to use the external um, viewer PDF viewer so whatever the output created by LaTeX will be in PDF portable document file so that's again a good feature in so the you can just cross cross check m m our code my title this is my first beam presentation this is the title and author social research insights I don't want to keep the date otherwise if I leave the date then uh, if I leave the blank without without using the comment date then I may be I may be having date here and next presentation next slide it is for the table of contents it is empty because I don't have sections right now in my presentation so we may not be able to see the table of contents and next this is my first slide slide number one first slide and second this is my second slide mm. and last one items see here my items item number one this is item number two this is item number three which means bulleted text this last slide and finally I can go and make the last begin frame centering thank you thank you so that again build it so my compiling message is blue which means I don't have view PDF.